Hey there folks, and welcome back to Italy in Europa Universalis for the Mario and Austrum expansion. So in the last episode, we were getting ready to declare war on England, who is currently in a war of their own. Uh, we're looking to take Yorkshire and London, because we need them uh, to form the Roman Empire. We need them as to be owned by us. And yeah, we're getting, we're getting those... Those provinces sort of out of the way. We still need Zealand and we still need a way to integrate Austria to get Vienna. Let's see. We're also very high on military power. For some reason I forgot to enact this this uh, policy earlier. To be fair, we almost sort of don't need it, but at the same time, mo better, mo better forces, right? Also note that uh, when we finish diplomatic ideas, we do have a lot of different policies we can enact to get diplomatic reputation if we really need it. Note that each point of diplomatic reputation is a 5% chance to inherit a, for a personal union, so... I mean, right here before us, we have a total of 20% chance to inherit. Uh, to go with the 10% we'll get from the Diplomatic Idea Group itself. So hopefully we can make that work. I mean, I don't really necessarily need the more money, but I'll take better infantry combat ability, sure. Slows down our military power gain, but we're already incredibly far ahead. Yeah, we're still, we're four and a year and a bit years ahead, and we're almost capped out. Yeah, that's, I'm not looking to pay that much. Let's grab, is this with the nobility? It is. Sure, let's spend a few points, get some manpower. Sure. All right, also worth noting that in the end of next year, Right. Yeah, the end of next year we'll be able to demand diplomatic support. So, looks like we should be able to get 150 diplo power at that point, so the, that will be nice. And pretty soon we're going to have the nobility back uh, to above 40% loyalty, so we won't have this malice anymore. Alright, for. Yeah, other than that, for now we're looking to, yeah, to declare war on England. Let's see. Spain is claiming things, it's fine. Bohemia is in their own war, which, you know, hey, it's fine. Ooh, gain of stability and diplo power, or gain 50 prestige and diplo power. Alright, well, is there, is there a way I can waste prestige? Oh, I can do this again? Alright, that, that works. Oh, it's just, it's just a thing you can keep doing? Cool, alright, that works. I mean, do I want to do it again? Then that would put us up to 92? Eh, sure. Why not? Alright. England. I have good news. Good news for me. Not for you. You probably don't like it. Sure. Take London. Right, they have... They have vassals. Iroquois and Brandenburg. I don't care about either of you, honestly. Sure. Conform. And... What are we talking about here? Alright, a reasonable amount of forces. But... I think our 
nigh on hundred stack ought to be a okay here. Oh, really? Interesting. Alright, well you guys head over that way. You guys, who do I have with the most siege? Alright. London is a only a level two fort. So let's split this in half. Head there. Alright, take one of you, one of you, one of you. Send them there. And let's get a blockade going. We got Brandenburg. Alright, overall it's a decently large war, but not too concerned about it. Brandenburg, how many forts do you have? Just the two. Alright. Alright, has arrived in Hampshire. Arrived in the Dogger Bank. Alright, good. Fortress is indeed obsolete for us. A 23 day siege, good. Good. Alright, with this... With this policy information, I'm feeling reasonably likely that we can at some point inherit Austria the problem is, uh, you can only inherit on Monarch Death. I still think it's fine. Eh, I'll improve relations with Bohemia for now. I don't worry about improving relations in Austria for the moment. Catholic zealots, all right. Sure, you guys go on ahead. Burgundy's got their stuff going. Right, there's Austria heading up that way. All right. I mean, I'm going to assume that they're fine against, like, Brandenburg. Brandenburg's got 7, 10, 19,000 troops. Yeah, that's not... It's not a lot. Alright. Alright, I guess, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Still hemmed in, hemmed in, in fact, by, uh, by London. There we go. Alright, you head marches, you head to Lincolnshire. Obviously none of you. I guess we could do that. <laughs> that is an option. You're not wrong, game. You're not wrong. As far as unhappiness goes. Hmm. That will go up significantly. Separatist. Eh, we'll deal with it. Is that? Oh, it's three heavies? Sure. Achievement unlocked. All your trade are belong to us. Ah. I was wondering if we were going to end up getting that one. So. Let me make sure I remember what that one is. I think that's 300 income plus control over the three European end nodes. Uh, Venice, Genoa, and the English Channel. Let's take a look. Have the highest trade power in Genoa, Venice, and the English Channel while having an income of at least 300 ducats per month. Indeed. Alright. Well, I mean, that's not terribly surprising. That we have 300 a month. Yeah, there we go. 
considering how large we are. But still, it's quite nice. We arrived in Martel and in Lincolnshire. Uh, do we have a bead on where the British troops are? I, in fact, do not see the red coats at all. All right. Well, then let's not worry about them. Trading in fish happened to us. Okay. All right. Let's grab a mercenary here. Right, fair enough. Eh, I will do two. A one four, you say? USA and La Plata. Interesting. This is Peruvian Conquest. Interesting. All right. Oh, well, in that case, you guys just head on back to your province. Go ahead and cancel that one. You head to Cornwall, one of you head to Somerset. It's the walls already. Not bad. Somerset. Yeah, we can't actually get there. Alright. Head to London. Gloucester. Cornwall. Medical Morgan. There we go. Can you walk across? You cannot. Alright. Park the boats. This is true. I've only got 45. Well then, take the other guy. Mr. Four Siege. And come on over. Come on over, baby. Interesting. Huh. Alright. Taking Gloucester and Oxford. Switzerland declared war on Baden. Cool beats. Let's head to Essex. We'll head to Lancashire. <laughs> Alright, I've taken over 
Glamorgan, you... Wait, what? Let's land on... You Portugal. Taking a rocks for sure. Taking a Rex. Exford. Essex. There we go. I can talk. Don't believe him, it's a lie. Hey, boys. Boys and falsehoods. I'm taking Lancashire. Tripoli. Right, we're fine tech wise. Yeah, I'm not going to wait that long for this war, that's for sure. Do they. July 2nd, really? I have more transports out and about? Interesting. Ah, and they even have troops. They have troops on those boats. Right, we arrived in Norfolk. Arrived in Marches. And we, oh yeah, we have taken Berlin. All right. Well, then that makes sense. No, thank you, Brandenburg. All right, England. All right, we want that, and we want that. All right, you're not far off. I was hoping to sink more, if I'm honest. No. <laughs> no, 1,400 ducats is not good enough. Oh, Syria is... Right. 39.7, that seems pretty good. Relations a little bit more. And the Darby. Thumberland. Alright, then come back from Syria. Alright, they're now on a low enthusiasm. Good. They would do that. I could wait for that to fall. Make them pay reps. I don't think I care anything about treaties, or nations, or subjects. A lot of overextension, quite a bit of aggressive ex Expansion. How far off are we? Not, not far at all.
Hi. Right. That's helpful. And whatever money. Sure. 100 ducats sounds cute. Right. You give us London, you give us Yorkshire. Which is all we need from you. I mean, I could, like, wait around and try to get war reps from Brandenburg, etc., etc., but it's, I don't... I don't care. This is fine. You go away. You away. You can go there. You, I guess, can go, sure, there. Those wouldn't happen to be in the same area, would they? Of course not. You know, considering they've up they've improved Yorkshire 12 times, they sure didn't put any buildings there. There's a shipyard in London, there's a shipyard in Kent. Yeah, I think I'll go ahead and make London a state once it's cored. I don't think I'm going to worry about about Yorkshire. Whoa. Really? Interesting. They're a kingdom. Oh, Lubeck is the Republic, of course. Of course. Alright, you were heading to Yorkshire. You were heading to Kent, and then we'll come pick you up. Alright. Cores. London. And Yorkshire. Yorkshire is reasonably upset. Kent is considerably upset. Are these all English separatists? They are. Alright, that seems fine then. Alright, I've got those going. We're three per month. That's fine. Go ahead and improve relations there a little bit more. Yes, indeed we have. Ottomans are claiming Cyprus. Sure thing. Obviously, can't land in pale. All marriage offer from Syria. I mean, that would solidify relations with them, but I think... 
think we're gonna be okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright, you guys on the boat. And then boat bring them home ish. <laughs> yes, home ish. Should we head somewhere over there? Hmm, I need more troops. I'm starting to spread myself kind of thin. Kind of, sort of. Right, 58. Well, I'm not going to replace them, but... This is true. If I had waited until December, uh, I could have gotten prestige from the war to make up for this, but I guess it's okay. Alright. So now up to 62... And if I... 20 influence is too much. Let's see, if I recruit a Master of Mint... 77% influence... I can demand 150 diplomatic power. Good deal. Alright, and with that... We're still at 69% loyalty. Titter, titter. Could have asked for contribution and get a ton of ducats. I could just let this tick down naturally. Because that would lose... Because that would only lose development cost. Sure, I'll go ahead and do that too. Other than that, I'm not too concerned about development cost. Let's go ahead and take this idea to make another Diplo point a month. There we go. We're a number of points away from the next one I actually care about, and then that one's going to be great, and that one will be fine. Also gives us that and the ability to do those other ideas. Right, can take up militarily, but not too concerned about doing that right now. Right, claims wise, can't giddy on get any on either of those. Also can't giddy either of those. Shoah, sure, Shoah. Sure. Unfortunate, but okay. Right, they're hitting there. And yeah, I think one army can handle this stuff over here. What modifier is this? Trusted Merchant Swoy. Alright, well, fine. Scenario still running around, do I? No. Well, that part is good. Alright, head back over here and get that army. 
guess we'll put them in Syria, somewhere through here anyway. I can send two armies after Ethiopia and have three go after the Ottomans. Do I care about Yemen? I don't think so. Alright folks, and with that, I'm going to call this an episode. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next one where we'll be declaring war on the Ottomans. Yeah, in March of 85. And maybe, possibly, getting uh, getting the next admin tech, which will be administrative efficiency. Eh? Eh? Anyway, hope to see you then.